So today we're going to be going through a uh, blues progression and using the song Freddy Freeloader as our basis, which is a very popular Miles Davis tune and it's in the key of B flat. And we're using all seventh chords for this one. So if you've been playing guitar for a while or you're familiar with the blues, you'll notice some uh, interesting harmony, which we'll talk about as well in this one. So let's break down the basic blues formula for the key of B flat. And so we're using all seventh chords. So chord one is the B flat seven, chord four is the E flat seven, and chord five is the F seven. And so this uh, extra little chord that's thrown in is an A flat seven. And then you can add this one here, which is an A diminished. And then that just steps nicely up to chord one. So I'm not a fan of these bar chords. I like to play my seventh chords like this, or even just like this. Okay. Same thing with the fifth string root. I don't really like those shapes, so I play the seventh shapes like that. Sometimes like that, which is the ninth. Okay, so they're all the chords we use in this blues song. And so the basic formula for a blues is four bars on chord one, two bars on chord four, two bars on chord one, and then the little turnaround goes um, chord five for one bar, chord four for another bar, and then usually back to chord one. But in this song, it uh, goes to the uh, A flat seven, which is the seventh degree and then it goes back to chord one at the beginning. So uh, a standard blues would go chord one for four bars, chord four for two, chord one for, four, for two, then it would go chord five, one bar, chord four, and then back to chord one, and sometimes we'll end on chord five. And in this song, we've got this little ending which goes chord five, chord four, and then to the um, A flat seven, and then you can walk it up like that. So hopefully that's helpful, just a really quick short lesson on uh, B flat blues. Thanks for watching, make sure you like and subscribe my YouTube channel, follow on my um, Facebook, Instagram and TikTok page. All the information for my socials will be uh, in this post, so just find it. Uh, go along and make sure you keep up to date with all the content that I'm putting out. And we'll see you in the next video.